And with that, Monica, the floor is yours. Good afternoon, everyone. How are you today? OK, good. One day, that's true. I will start today with um, uh, save the date for your diary, but it's actually for Monday. So the General Assembly will host uh, on 15th July an informal plenary meeting on gender equality and women's leadership for a sustainable world. The informal group of eminent leaders was established last year. The objective is to promote gender equality and empowerment of women, which has been one of Ms. Espinosa's top priorities. The event, which will start at 10 a.m. at the ECOSOC Chamber, will be the second meeting of the group of gender equality leaders. The PJ believes that women decision makers must lead by example to safeguard the achievements and accelerate progress towards gender equality for all women and girls. The informal plenary meeting will bring together this diverse group of leaders who share a common goal to accelerate the promotion of gender equality and the empowerment of women in their own communities and around the world. In line with this uh, theme of this year's high-level political forum on sustainable development, the event will focus on empowerment, equality, and inclusion as critical elements to achieve the Sustainable Development Goals. The PGA, the PGA elect, and the Deputy Secretary General, Ms. Amina Mohammed, will deliver opening remarks, followed by two panel discussions on women's leadership, a call to action, and gender equality and inclusive societies for sustainable development. Among the participants are Ms. Helen Clark, former Prime Minister of New Zealand, the head of UN Women, Ms. Pumzili Imlambo Nguka, the Secretary General of the Ibero-American Organization, Ms. Rebecca Greenspan, and Mr. Guy Ryder, Director General of the ILO. Both panels will be moderated by the Ambassadors of Switzerland, His Excellency Mr. Jörg Lauber, and of Rwanda, Her Excellency Ms. Valentini Huagbiza. For a complete list of speakers and a dedicated website, you can go to our web page. And the PJ has issued a tweet to mark World Population Day on this 11th July. Ms. Espinosa has asked international leaders and peoples around the globe to invest in population issues and to focus on health for all. The President of the General Assembly affirmed that gender equality is crucial to achieving the Sustainable Development Goals. Ms. Espinosa also said that the reproductive health and women's empowerment go hand in hand. And finally, on her agenda, she is holding separate bilateral meetings with the Director General of the International Development Law Organization, Ms. Irene Khan. And she later will take part in the reception in honor of the anniversary of the accession to the throne of His Serene Highness, Prince Albert II of Monaco. This is all from us. Do you have anything? If you don't, I would say have a wonderful afternoon. I see you tomorrow. Thank you. And on Monday, we're going to have it's at, yeah, our, our press conference here. OK? Thanks. <laughs>